Hey guys, welcome back. So I made it out to another Cars and Coffee deal. Uh, Circle Drive, Saskatoon, uh, Tim Hortons. And it's been raining off and on here, kind of spitting all morning, but uh, it hasn't really affected the turnout here. You guys can see it is completely, completely packed here. There's a ton of people, a ton of neat cars. I thought I'd do a walk around. I'd, I'm not going to get to everything, but I'm going to do my best and show you some of it. As always, I see stuff here that I don't always see. I don't know if you can hear that in the background, but that's actually a drag truck. Uh, it's actually a drag truck. So this guy trailers us in and uh, just brought it out in the last few weeks. actually drag cars show up. Custom Sport Convertible. I don't know that I've seen this car before. Buckets Council, black interior, prettiest kind of mauve exterior. It's got a neat looking wheel on there too. Wow. It's a really nice uh, cutlass. This one looks new to me as well. Buckets Council Block Interior. Nice looking original car. And another one I haven't seen before. A little Chevy. Sit down. This Cars and Coffee deal is just becoming more popular all the time and, you, and this is the kind of stuff to see. Just everything, just different. <laughs> different stuff here every week. Really nice Mustang. 65 Mustang Fastback. really cool with the red lines and we've seen this truck before this is really nice air conditioning power steering power brakes really pretty big Merc nice Galaxy here 390 car Wow That's really nice. Yeah, I don't typically get to uh, this corner of the lot here, but I'm going to, yeah, they go all the way down the row here. Some dailies in there, so what I'm gonna do is turn around and Try and get over to the main lot where most of the cars are. This little custom truck here is new to me, also. It's got a wild hood on it, super low. The windows are up and they're tinted. I can't see inside there, but that's a really cool custom truck. Very nice. Nice 
little rally 350 cutlass. That's nice. And Doug 69 Mark 1. Got a prowler over here I've never seen before. This is new to me. Lots of pinstripe work on this one. And the windows are up. Like I say, it was raining a few minutes ago, so. Very cool. I see a lot of late model stuff on that side of the row. I think I'm going to scoot over. So I'm missing a lot of cars here, guys, but there's just too much to catch. A really pretty square body. I've seen this truck either. And it's difficult to see in there. Windows are up. Studebaker, we've seen that. Audi Quattro. Lots of carbon fiber there. I believe we saw this little 69 Roadrunner last night. It's a really nice clean car. 383 column shift buckets, black interior. Real pretty car. And this, I've never seen this before either. This looks like a really nice original Dodge push button that's cool Chrysler pardon me Chrysler and we've got some dragons here uh, Ron's car we've done a walk around on this one that's a really neat hot rod also Ted's car real pretty and Daryl's truck, 63 Shorty. And somebody brought out their GMC one ton. There's the everything here. Oh. It's got an LS in it. Wow, you don't see that every day. Very cool. And I don't even know what this is. It's the tiniest right-hand drive car. I've never seen this before. I, I can't even comment on this. I don't know what it is. It's got drag radios all around. 
some kind of little Japanese version of a Mazda. Ah, Garen's car. This one, I have seen this before. I don't think it shows up on the channel, so... Uh, my boss used to own this car, and he sold it to a buddy of mine. And then it moved down the line to another fella. And this fella's given this car a lot of love. It was a field car that is getting saved. I'm used to I really like those, body, those uh, body styles. That's a custom sport, just like the um, Hella SS. I did do an alignment on this car for this fella a few years ago. Buckets Council. It's just a real neat, honest survivor. Really cool. And Al's, we've done a walk around on this one. We saw this. GTO last night as well as the Nova. A little Nash truck. What are the headlights out of? Uh, that's the headlights that are in the, uh, the headlight. This is what the headlight got for. Uh, Supercharged. Supercharged F 150 Harley Davidson truck. That's pretty cool. Excursion. <laughs> Lots of different stuff here as always. We've also done a walk around video on Jeff's truck here. This is really neat. Villa brought out his horseless carriage again. He gets a lot of attention with that. He's actually given people rides in the parking lot with that little car. And I believe that he also owns this truck here. And uh, my car is occupying this space. I got to quit calling this thing my junk. Uh, I'm getting a lot of comments about that. Actually, to be honest, guys, I really like this car. It's been it's been good to me. I really enjoy driving that thing, so I, you know, I'll stop calling it my junk. And next to me here is this pretty little Dodge Monaco. Uh, this was painted recently by my good buddy at Wild West Auto Body. He did an amazing job on this car. Couldn't have been easy to block a car like that. It was really super long that's nine foot long quarter panels on there that are super flat and if you make a mistake with something like this you're going to certainly see it in a dark color it's a nice car so joe did an amazing job on that and we're right back at the beginning here with rob's car so there we go guys another cars and coffee event uh like I say, a rainy morning, but still well attended. People just love coming here, and they're always seeing something new every week, which just never fails. So, anyway, thanks very much for watching. I appreciate.